Despite severe box office setbacks, Kevin Costner is optimistic about the future of The Horizon, an American saga series. Chapter 1, the first of a four-part film series, was released on June 28. Only $34.3 million was made at the box office out of a $50 million budget, meaning it was unable to recoup its costs. Even worse, Costner had scheduled the release of Chapter 2 for August 16, but the distributor refused to ship Chapter 1 to theaters due to its financial difficulties. The other films in the Horizon franchise are also in jeopardy, even though it seems that the sequel might not have a theatrical release. Costner is still confident that he can bring the series to a satisfying conclusion, in spite of all of its obstacles. Costner revealed in a Today interview that he is devoted to the Horizon films and intends to see them through to completion, despite Chapter 1's failure. He intends to return in the spring of 2025 to finish the franchise, having already started work on Chapter 3. See his entire statement below. I adore this thing's journey. I adore this movie, but it's been the toughest thing I've ever done. The second one is my favorite. The third is much more difficult than the first two, and the fourth wraps up the plot. I'm making a valiant effort to fulfill a promise I made to myself. I want to share these kind of epic tales with people and hope they become enamored with the characters. The things you wish to make often don't connect with other people right away. People don't really get what it was until after you're through, and then they practically start to claim ownership of the phrase, I love this movie. These are my favorite characters. I had no idea where this tale was headed. Being taken by surprise is pleasant in life. The idea is that I've already partially recorded the third, and possibly to shoot them consecutively the next spring. When will Horizon be shown again in theaters? In addition to facing financial difficulties, Horizon, an American Saga. Chapter 1 faced negative reviews for Costner's most recent project, which contributed to its enormous failure. It was classified as rotten with a 49% reviewer score on Rotten Tomatoes. However, audiences were more favorable, as seen by the 70% rating that the audience's popcorn meter gave it. A $50 million film, Chapter 2's theatrical release was cancelled due to negative reviews and unsatisfactory box office performance. To guarantee that Chapters 3 and 4 are developed at all, further funding will probably be required. Of course, it still has a chance to succeed because Chapter 1 is currently available for streaming on Max. The strategy for financial success was always going to include streaming, even while box office revenue remained a significant component of the outcome. It's unlikely that the franchise will be accepted back for another theatrical release after it failed to make its budget, much less the $125 million required for profitability after theaters deducted their part. The Venice Film Festival will still host the world premiere of Horizon, an American saga, Chapter 2, and the response of reviewers may play a significant role in influencing the terms of a wider distribution. Thankfully, Costner's commitment to the brand might offer an alternative that works. It has been reported that he contributed around $40 million of his personal funds to the Horizon films. Costner will probably take the biggest hit even if it turns out to be a financial bust, and he has already stated that he is willing to carry on with the movie development. If it offers a better deal, investors might lend greater support. After Chapter 1's terrible performance, Horizon, an American saga is unlikely to see the light of day in theaters, but it can yet be completed.